Hello everyone, and welcome to a Feed the Beast Let's Play. Um, I downloaded this Feed the Beast pack. It is the, uh, does it show on here? Yeah, test pack, please ignore, 1.0.2. You can get it on the Reddit forums. It's pretty cool. I've been messing around with it for probably, I would say, 30 minutes now or something. I just started using it, and I just started using feed the beast so i really don't know what i'm doing so it should be uh, rather entertaining actually it took me a long time to get a feed the beast pack that i liked at first i used the monster pack and i didn't like that pack because it was too it had um it didn't have greg tech and i really liked the concept of greg tech and sure i could just install greg tech and run it but the Greg Tech configuration files are too, um, you know, I gotta get some coal here. I'm looking for coal. Uh, the Greg Tech configuration files are way too complicated for me to get what I wanted because Greg Tech vanilla actually changes vanilla recipes. Like an iron pickaxe would cost like a circuit, a hammer, a file, all kinds of crazy stuff. And uh, yeah, so I'm looking for some coal. Uh, does my guy look okay? No. Something's wrong with my uh, skin here. I don't know why. And... Yeah, that sounds like I'm breaking iron blocks. Okay. Oh, well. Hopefully that'll get changed within later editions. Wait, did that sound like iron too? does oh well all right so i'm gonna get some coal here uh, i'm gonna go mining i might show some some of the mining or i might show all of it probably gonna show all of it actually i'm a pretty quick explorer as far as caves go so i'm gonna go get some what does this do oh strength interesting and what does this do haste Ooh, that's kind of cool Interesting. Um, okay, so let's go get some sticks here. And I'm going to go mining. There's a cave just like right over there where we just were. Pretty good cave, so hopefully we'll find something. Alright, so let's go. So. One second here. I want to try to find diamond or find some form of. I want to get to the lower levels is what I'm trying to say. I don't want to be going through all the the medium stuff. I really like opal too. That's opal down there. Um, as you can see, I was here a little bit. I did some mining. I didn't do too much. I didn't go this deep, I don't think. Oh, shit. I didn't think he wants to kill me. Oh, well. Let's get some tin. I want to try to get a quarry, and I ended up looking up the recipe for quarries, and the recipe was extremely. Uh, the recipe was really, really hard to do. It was really in depth. Holy zombies! Um, yeah, it was hard to do. I needed like, I think I need like five diamonds or six diamonds to do it. I don't know. Six diamonds, and then like all kinds of other stuff. It's pretty expensive. So, we're going to be holding off that for now. Uh, it's a little mini Enderman. Oh, I just looked at him. Alright, let's fight. Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Uh, I'll show you guys this stuff here. Opal. And it actually mines out the color you mine it, so... See how it's purple? And then if I get this stuff here, which is also opal... Oh, wait. Oh, oh, jeez. Oh, God, that's a real one. Oh, no. Oh, I got him. Oh. Oh, I got a zombie head. Oh, God, another zombie. Oh, I never found a zombie head, even on my normal world. That's pretty cool. Okay, so <laughs> before I was rudely interrupted, uh, where is that? Huh? Did I throw away my meat? Oh, no. I, did I eat it? I don't know. So, anyways... Does it change? 
Opal cobblestone. Okay. Huh. Okay, so you can mine it. See how that's a different color? I don't get this. So I mined purple opal. And now it should be purple, right? Oh, maybe it's not. No, I just placed purple. This doesn't make sense to me. Huh? That's opal. And then I just placed the purple cobblestone. There's one. Okay, well, let's go mining. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I should have saw that. Okay, what's this? Migmanite. Migmatite. Interesting. Uh, oh, gosh, skeleton. That. Okay, so what did we find here? That's clay. Oh, I didn't know clay was down here. Uh, I don't know what this stuff does, but it looks pretty cool, so I just keep mining it when I see it. I'm sure I'll find out. I'm sure, like, sometime I'll, be, I'll find out what it actually does, and I'll be so happy I mined all of it that I saw. That came out really butchered, but I hope you guys... <gasps> Diamonds! <laughs> okay, so we got that. That's good. What is this? Um, blue topaz. Interesting. Osmium... Osmium ore. Huh. Osmium is actually a really cool element. Um, funny, because I used to be really interested in chemistry. I gotta turn particles off. Um, I used to be really interested in chemistry. Where's particles? Oh, no. <laughs> Animations? Oh, it's a, oh, no. Particles, decrease, minimal. That's good. Okay, so I used to be really interested in chemistry, and there's this one element called osmium that I was really interested in, and um, my chemistry teacher ended up telling me all kinds of things about it. Apparently, it is osmium, the element in real life, is almost as strong as diamond, I believe. It has a really, really high, uh, ooh, what's the word I'm looking for? I don't think it's density. Um, Hardness, I think that's what it's called. It has a really high hardness. So, that's pretty cool. Ooh, what's this? Essence ore. Magical crops. Yeah, I actually have a lot of things installed. I have 172 mods. Uh, mods and two of those mods are not from the original pack. Oh, no, no, no. Two of those mods are not from the original pack. They are from... No. Aww. Only you guys saw my face when I did that. Granulite. Okay, so two of the mods, two of the mods are not from the original pack. Um, the one mod that's not from is Optifine, and the other one is Geostrata, which is giving me all this cool marble and uh, where was it? Gran, uh, Migmatite and Granulite. So yeah. I don't know what. The, oh, what? I don't know what this stuff does. Osmium. Hold shift. A strong mineral. I knew it was strong. Any height in the world. Construction. Cool. Okay, so. We found diamonds. It's pretty much what I wanted. Only got two, though. Uh, there's not much more for me to really talk about, so I think I'm going to cut it. I'm going to explore a little bit more of the cave. Uh, I'm not planning to explore all of it because, as you can see, there's tons of it. Oh, gosh, a skeleton. And I'll see you guys back at the uh, ravine. Come on. Die. All right, I'll see you guys back. Okay, so I was going to go back to the cave. And just over yonder, I paused the video. And then I came to this big ravine. I mean, look at all the stuff in this ravine. You got redstone, that stuff, that stuff, coal, I think that's cinnabar, that essence stuff. I don't know what that is. Now, you just got all kinds of stuff. And then just over here, 
Found some diamonds. So we're going to go check out the diamonds. See how many there is. I hope it's more than... Oh, uranium is pretty expensive too. Pretty neat little area. Not gonna lie. I might have to uh, make my base down here. That would be kind of cool. Okay, so let's check out what this how many diamonds there are only one uh, that's kind of pathetic oh well all right i'll see you guys back at the base creeper gonna try to kill you gonna try to kill you oh what huh okay <laughs> oh no oh, i'm gonna die uh, so I'm trying to find my place here, and, and I'm not in a good spot. Yeah, I was dead. All right, well, I think I know where I am. I just kind of got lost for a second. I seriously thought that creeper was going to kill me, though. Okay, uh, I think I'm just... Honestly, I don't know where I am. I know where I died, but that's not too helpful. No, get away from the spider. All right, I found home, and I'm gonna do something that I should probably do, or should probably have done a long time ago. Uh, I always do this, or I usually do this, and I advise people to um, do something similar. If you are pretty prone to losing your way, or you die a lot, and you always have to come back to your spawn point or your base, and you find your base is underground and it's hard to find, or you want to find where you left your cave last, or for whatever reason, you just want to get a, a landmark. Um, okay. You, you do this here. You do, oh man, I'm really screwing this up. So you do a pillar of cobble, um, however high you want, and then you do four pieces of cobble one below and then where's my torches and then you put a torch on each side like so and then you do a torch on top of here and then you do a torch all around this top piece of cobble like so and now you won't have any problems with finding your base at least I don't have problems when I do it. All right, now let's get down here. No, oh, that's bad. Um, any water? I need to get a water bucket or something so I can easily get down. Or I could just take this path down here too. Okay. So there is one thing I wanted to do before I end the episode. And what I want to do, actually, is I want to I want to make some new tools. Apparently, if you take ruby or sapphire, which I have quite a bit of. I might have more in here, too. Yeah. And you put them in a tool sort of configuration, you get a ruby pickaxe. Now, I don't know what's better, ruby or sapphire. I'm assuming Ruby's better. So we're gonna get a Ruby pickaxe. Yeah, a Ruby, I think Ruby's better. A Ruby pickaxe and a Ruby sword. Actually, let's use some sapphires for the sword, there. And a sapphire. How fast is it? Oh, that's pretty fast. Okay, sweet. Okay, so um, there's not much else I know I really wanna do now. I think we could, yeah, let's let's uh, start smelting some stuff here. I have a lot of minerals, as you can see. And honestly, I haven't even been playing long. It's just, I don't know. I'm getting lucky, I guess. Oh, I hear you. So what I want to do, too, before I end the episode, is I want to go and set up a real base. I don't really like this ravine as a base. I kind of just used it for easy access. And uh, that area we were last, oddly enough, it was a ravine. But that area we, we left, that in the cave, that was really cool. And I think we could use that as a base. Some form of like underground 
hermit dwarven base type idea. That'd be pretty cool. Um, what is this? Osmium ingot. Let's see what these are made. What these do. A blaze rod and. Huh? Oh, that's a bone. Oops. Okay. What do they make? Osmium rod. Osmium nugget. Osmium dust. Ooh, that's a kind of that's a pretty nice looking block. Crusher. Gas tank. Hold shift. Inventory false. That's helpful. A metallurgic infuser. M for a description. Oh, hold shift and M. A machine used to infuse various materials into generally metals to create metal alloys and other interesting. Osmium plate. Yeah, it's kind of cool. Cool. Okay, so I got the stuff smelting. I want to try one more thing too. Now this is pretty noob. But there's actually a lot of beehives, and I want to get into bees pretty quickly. Oh, where are you coming from? Who's your daddy? Oh, shoot. I think I'm going to be your daddy soon. Got him. Okay, so I want to get into bees rather quickly here. Um, I think they're really interesting, and a lot of people seem to praise them. So I want to, I want to look at them. Um... Okay, let's see what I want to do here. I don't have any more coal, so I can't really smelt much more stuff. Ooh, uranium ingots. Ooh, that's kind of cool looking. Uh, what else can I throw in there? Let's throw the aluminum in. Aluminium. Uh, we need some meat as well. Steak. I had pork chop. I don't know what I did with them, though. Maybe I ate them. Yeah, I think I ate them. Aluminum nugget. Oh, okay. So we could throw this in here. That's good. Okay, so let's go see the bees. Um, there's a couple hives outside of my area here. So I'm going to go check those out. This is all new to me. I've never played modded Minecraft before. I usually just play vanilla. And uh, oddly enough, I was watching... Uh, a YouTuber and oh man, how am I gonna get out of here? I was watching a YouTuber play uh, Feed the Beast, and uh, it just seemed really cool. And I was like, oh, that seems really cool, interesting, and I'm gonna try it. So I downloaded the launcher, and I figured, oh, I have a fast computer. Oh, that's bad. Um, I have a fast computer. I won't need to uh, have any issues with Feed the Beast, right? Because people have a lot of lag when they play it. Nope, I had tons of lag. I lagged a lot. I would have good FPS, but I would get these really, really high spikes of uh, FPS drop, like FPS drops. Let's see if I can mine this out here. Actually, unusual. Mm, that's probably a pretty good beehive. So let's go something simple, like something simple, like uh, common or something. Uh, do I see anything? I know there's tons around here. unusual okay so we have another one okay we'll try this does it mine it does not mine interesting okay so there's no way for me to mine bees I'm gonna try one more thing I'm gonna try a diamond pickaxe and then see where that goes Okay, so I found the beehive just up here. Made the diamond pickaxe, and we're going to see if we can mine it. There. See if we can mine it. Nope. <laughs> oh, man. Okay. Well, that sucked. I wonder what you use to mine the uh, 
beehives or get them. Maybe just like a special tool. But I could have swore I saw someone playing Feed the Beast and they they used a pickaxe, a diamond pickaxe. And they mined it, so. Hmm, I have to look that up. Maybe only certain ones can be mined? No. Oh well. Alright, so we're gonna move the base. I'm gonna move everything over to that other area we were just at with the lava and the big ravine. That seemed like a pretty cool area. And we'll set up shop there. And uh, actually, while I do that, I'm also going to check to see what you can use to get uh, beehives. And what tools you need. Because apparently pickaxes aren't the, the proper ones. Alrighty. Alright guys. So I'm coming down here and this is the last of my stuff. And I placed a chest right there. And I said to my... frame rates um i said to myself oh uh, uh, wouldn't it be funny if a creeper spawned there and look look who spawned there yeah there he is yep probably gonna blow up all my stuff oh yeah he's coming he's coming towards us i don't like you and your family there we go all right so i was going to unpause it once i was fully transferred but it's close enough there was a few things I left back at the uh, old old area there, but uh, they aren't worth that much. They weren't really that good. Whoa, God. Oh, it's an angry zombie with gold armor. How is that for fun? Anyways, so... Yeah, so we're moved down here. We are good to go. Um, what we need... What I'm starting to realize that we need to do is we need to get a cow farm going so I can get meat and I don't have to starve because I'm having a lot of troubles uh, staying saturated on my hunger bar. So that's something we should look into doing. But uh, this episode's ran long enough, so I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. I know I did, and uh, I'll see you again next time. This cave is crazy. Alright, peace.